Always a terrific venue to watch a football match. I'm talking about the Emirates Stadium here in North London. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It's Arsenal facing Burnley. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Here are the starters for Arsenal. Well, it's regarded as a negative shape. But if they control the middle of the park, play some expansive football, the wide players can then come in field to join the centre forward and the fullbacks can push on. Let's hope they do that today. And this the initial 11 for Burnley. Nick Pope gets the nod between the posts. Ben Mee plays alongside James Tarkovsky in central defence. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Thank you for attending the Emirates Stadium. Enjoy the match. And the game begins. Lacazette. Ashley Westwood on the ball. Well, not quite what he wanted to do with the pass. Martin Odegaard, an attack that's easy on the eye, and Lacazette with options around him. A really top-notch piece of defending. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Jay Rodriguez. Here's me. Oh, that's a fine pass. The ball back with Arsenal now. Tommy Yasu. Bukayo Saka. It's with Erdogan. And possibilities here. Really good timing stop to make sure the threat came to nothing. And taken short. It's a neat move. Timely intervention. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Good movement. Chance to cross. Really good challenge. Tomiyasu, Saka, Martin Odegaard, they're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them, he continues his run, it's still alive, and there it is, an almost intuitive piece of finishing. Well, here's the replay, and this is what you're always told as a kid. Go for the far post, make it difficult for the keeper, and then hope your teammate is ready for any rebound. He does exactly that, and they get their reward. What a good goal that was.
And back underway. 1 0 it is. Lacazette. Gabriel Martinelli. Will he play it in? Martinelli pulls it back. High echelon goalkeeping there. Short corner taken. White. Well, it was close to the target, but close isn't good enough, really. Albert Sambi Lokonga. Martin Odegaard. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. And over comes the corner. And he clears the danger. And he takes on the shot. There it is. Two to the good now. And that gives them a buffer. Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. Well, a second goal for them here. But attacking possibilities. A chance to whip it in. Tierney. Tierney. Fluency of movement. He cuts it back. There it is! The goals keep coming. No stopping them today. Well, just look at the setup here. It's such a clever back hill, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. So back with the action, and Arsenal sprinting away with ease. Well, he's outplayed and outfought him. And a significant block following that cross. Well, foul play, says the referee. Well, the referee deciding that it didn't warrant a yellow card being handed out. And a fine cross. It was always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Well, 
Well, as you can see, Arsenal have had most of the ball. They've passed it well, their movement's been good, and they've been well worth their lead. Could get even better here. Run it magnificently and intercepted. And the referee has decided to add on three additional minutes. Well, able to close down the short. Martin Odegaard. Martinelli. Can he play it in? Kieran Tierney. Albert Sambi Lokonga. So the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Yeah, he's done everything you want from a midfield player. He's wriggled out of tight situations, he's played a lot of forward passes, and he's also defended well. His assist is just the icing on the cake. Off and running again as we reflect upon an eye-catching first-half display from Arsenal. Gabriel Martinelli. Space and time for the cross. Well, they've won the ball back quickly. Lennon. Rodriguez with it. Cork. Ashley Westwood on the ball. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. Rodriguez, Lennon, Barnsley, great opportunity, oh a superb save, clears it away. Saka, Lacazette, Tommy Yasu. Martin Odegaard. A meaty but fair challenge, and it will be a throw-in. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. And players waiting in the centre. And a goal kick given. Martinelli. Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. And using his body to good effect. Effective looking pass. One block after another. And there's the delivery. Smuggled away. Well, strong play here. Take it away. And the counter attack is on. Options available. Could be threatening. Lotan. And space to cross it. So a deflection, and they can get ready for the corner kick routine. And time for the change now.
He's driven in the corner. And the danger cleared. Tarkovsky. Could be troublesome. Terrific block. Applying vigorous pressure. Throw into Arsenal coming up. Well, this game ebbing away, and Arsenal have been brilliant, Stuart. Well, what an excellent performance this has been. They've had complete control for most of the game. Their movement, clever passing and energy have been a joy to watch. It's been a really good win for them. Well, that's a foul, and it sets up a free kick in a dangerous position. Well, far from the perfect effort, you've got to say. Well, he's got that all wrong, hasn't he? That's a terrible effort. Westwood. Dale Stevens has it. And the pass was just that little bit off. Nearly found its target. Well, they get the ball once more. A really sumptuous ball. Offside it is. Such a pity for him. Well, he thought he was onside, but I think the assistant got that absolutely right. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. Lennon. Rodriguez. Very good reading of the game to win possession back. Gabriel. And so into the final five minutes. And tidily played. Tierney. Cross fired over. A deft clearance. Thomas Partey. Chance to cross. Tomiyasu. Partey. Cuts it back. Marcinelli. And offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. So there goes the final whistle. It ends in a victory for Arsenal. Maximum points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening. And they played really well. What a performance that was today. Well, he kept asking questions. Martin Odegaard. What did you make of what you saw from him? Yeah, not much more you could ask for, really. Plenty of effort, a goal, and most importantly, the right result. He should be happy with today.